Hey guys, um, this is like my freaking like fourth attempt at this video. It's 11:30 at night, but this is this is important. Um, this is my response video to Ellen DeGeneres' video um, about Larry uh, King in Oxnard, California. Um, in case you guys don't know about it, you can either watch her video. Um, the link should be underneath, or um, I'll put it over there. Here's like at the the side, right? one of these, but I'm pretty sure it's that one. Anyways, um, my mom told me about this, but I didn't really follow up on it. Or someone told me, I don't know. But, um, Larry King was an 8th grader. I think he was 15, 14 or 15, and he was gay. And I had to use the word was. Was gay. And, um, he asked someone, to, another boy, in his grade to be his valentine, and a few days later, um, he killed Larry, because he was gay. He still would be if he was alive, but he's not. And it's sad that 14-year-old, a 14-year-old boy killed, killed another boy, because he was gay, at age 14. Shit, I'm 16. I could never, ever, 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 ever kill someone. Ever. No matter how much I hated them. And this kid's two, two years younger than me. And he did it. And I'm like, wow. Wow. I'm speechless. How could someone do that? And that's how fucked up our world is. It really is. It's... You know, what made this kid, this 14-year-old kid, think that being gay is so horrible? And, you know, you have, you have like, 10-year-olds saying, that's so gay. And do they even know what it means? Do they even know what gay is? Like, I was 10 and didn't even know what it was. And, um, you know, these kids are saying that's so gay, and fag, and homo, and everything. It's throwing around the hall every single day at school. I mean, it's not like I can stop people from saying it, but I don't understand why. I really don't get what we say. We can say fag and stuff, but yeah, we can't say the, you know, if we say the n-word, you know, we can't say the n-word, but it's alright to say fag. They're both horrible words. Neither of them should be said. Because they're both offensive. And I don't get it. And I hate that word. I hate the F word and I hate the N word. And it's ridiculous. You know, it shouldn't matter if a person is gay or bi or lesbian or black or Asian or whatever, or their culture or what they look like or how they dress. It should not matter. Because everyone is a person. Everyone has feelings. And everyone has a value to them. And no one understands that in this world. And it is disgusting. And people who are like religion freaks and are like, God hates fags. Or gay people are going to hell. God said, um, you know, don't hate one another and everything. And I believe in God. I pray. And I believe... That God made me this way, but then again, you have to take your own opinion. But I believe God made me this way, and that He will still love me in the end. And it's ridiculous. I said the word ridiculous like 10 million times, but I don't care. It's stupid, and our world is so judgmental. You can't even walk down the street without having someone make fun of you. If you're overweight, they chuckle at you and go, Oh, he's fat. If you fall down, they laugh at you. If you stumble with your words, they make fun of you. If you have a funny hairstyle, a funny haircut, they make fun of you. People in this world are so mean and judgmental and unaccepting and cruel and sick. And for a 14 year old boy to do what he did, 
Our world has no hope. It has no chance. You know, I have no chance on... And I'm not just making this video because I'm gay. If I'm straight, I would do it too. I'm with Ellen on this one. I, I love you, Ellen. Just for that, you're amazing. And I hope you all watch the video, please. Thank you. Good night.